I know what you're saying. You're saying, Nicolas, there is an ugly margin here. How are you gonna reset it? You need to reset it, you need to change it. It looks ugly. On my SAS, I can do it. How about style components? Do I make one component for the body? No, relaxed, chill out. We are going to import something called Inject Global. All right, and here at the top of our file, we're going to say Inject Global back ticks and what I want to inject globally. I'm going to say body must be a padding zero in a margin, what in a motherfucker, in a margin, motherfuck, in a margin of zero. If we refresh, there we go. Look at that beauty. That's it. Look at how cool it is. It's so effortless. It's insane. All right, but now you will tell me, Nicolas, this is all great. I can make buttons, but what if I want to use the same button, but I want to make it an anchor, a link, all right? What if I want to reutilize, recycle my components? I want to make this one a link. What can I do? Help me. Look at this. We're going to do something called extensions. We're going to extend the button and we're going to say button. No, let's call it anchor with a capital A equals and we're going to say button with component. And which component do you want? An anchor. There you go, anchor. That's it. So now here I can have my anchor. And guess what? I don't need to do any matter of fact, I don't need to do anything at all. Go to Google. If I want to config, if I want to pass any other props, why? Because the style component is so fucking brilliant that he knows that the anchor has a H, uh, H reference. That's how brilliant it is, right? And here we're gonna go to Google. Done. And now look at this beauty. Now I have the same things, but with an anchor. Of course it looks different because the button, this button has a different uh, styles. We can change that later. But look at that. You just saved your time. You saved your keyboard. You saved everything. And now you have a button with the component anchor. How cool is that? But check this out. This one has an underline here. And this is not what we want. So we can just extend it. So we can take everything from the button we can use the button CSS with an anchor tag, and also we can extend the motherfucker, and we can say text decoration none. And you are good to fucking go. Look at this beauty. You extend the component here, and you change the tag here. This means that you could make anything you want with any tag. You could make a paragraph and then in one second turn it into a H1 and use the same fucking CSS. And look at this, no more class names. Never again. Awesome. I'm gonna see you on the next video while you keep shaking your pants because this is something unbelievable. See you on the next one.